Every Fortnite YouTuber now has their own creative map. So today I'm going to find out if any of them are actually good. You can turn on cheats. What? It gets absolutely crazy. And I'm going to be ranking them on this tier list throughout this video. Okay, so we're hopping on to Asian Jeff's map. It's ranked box PVP. Plus two rice. It is pretty quick from when the match ends to when the new round starts, which is actually kind of cool. Is that Jeff talking? <laughs> no way. Visit Jeff's dog and visit Jeff's room. Grandma sleeping on the bed, bro. Grandma rotated dead side. Oh my God. My grandma just rotated in. Visit Jeff's dog. His dog is missing. All right, Jeff. I am a fan of this map. I think you definitely put your flair and touch on the box fight 1v1. I'm going to give this one a B plus. All right, Lachlan, let's see what this map's all about. Its floor is lava in tilted towers. I'm assuming it's going to be like OG loot with floor is lava. Floor is lava, by the way, is one of my favorite, favorite, favorite LTNs. Survive the rising lava and be the last one standing. So we, we get some OG loot, blue pump, P90, AK, some boogie bombs too. Lava is rising, bro. My whole screen is shaking and this UI looks clean. That, that actually feels like a live event about to go down. GG, Macy, I'm sorry. Wait, do you see that kill effect? There's like an effect that happens when you kill somebody. I got a purple pump now. Look, the lava is coming up, bro. Is it going to one-shot me? I'm not, I don't even want to find out. I like this, though. I like this, Lachlan. Oh, the one pump to the face. Jump in the lava. All right, this is a really honest and good take at the Lava LTM that used to be in Fortnite. I'm going to say this is a big W. It's not, a, it's not a new idea, but it's unique in Fortnite creative, and it's really well made. I'm going to give this one an A-. minus. Okay, Dagwami and Birdo, they're popular on TikTok, and they made minigame box PvP. Almost 30,000 players on this map right now. These are all the different minigames. Oh, you get to vote. Okay, I think we're doing color switch. All right, I'm on purple right now. I just got I just got to stay put. I just got to stay put. Bro, I'm going to win just by minding my own business. Next color is green. All right, I'm staying in this corner right here. Buddy, you're not going to land on I don't know what bro is doing. All right, 1v1 situation right here. Next color is blue, and I got an impulse. Don't do it, buddy. I got to redeploy. I got to redeploy. I can't even do anything about, about this one. Maybe I can. Maybe I can. Maybe I can. Take some storm damage. Pull him. Oh, I got to keep him in storm. I got to send him in storm immediately on this next one. Cyan, dude. Oh my God, I went in too late. All right, all right, all right. All right, I got to get my revenge. All right, Hog Rider, catch knockback. I'm going to vote for Hog Rider, but it seems like everybody wants to play catch. Bro, random throwables are everywhere. I'll start with a stink on this guy. I'll put that out there. This guy's trying to run into my box. I'll put that over there. Get another stink on him. I got I got a clinger right here. This guy's looking at me with his clinger. That's not good. Oh, oh, there's mythic. Oh, whoa, whoa, chill, chill, chill. That thing would one shot me, right? I just got one shot. Okay, I'm not gonna lie. This one has been my favorite so far. It's box PVP, but honestly, it's not even really box PVP. It's just a bunch of different mini games. And I've only played two of them and they've been really well made. So this is gonna be our first S tier. Let me know in the comments if you agree or disagree, but I think this one is really well made. So I'm giving it an S tier. Fortnite Funland from Nick A30. I'm not gonna lie. I've seen clips of this map. I actually haven't hopped on myself. What is this music playing? Is there henchman rap music playing? Oh, uh, there's some Nick A30 voice lines. That guy was not family friendly. <laughs> never give up. <laughs> Q for Cosmic Frisbee. Okay, the game started. Wait, we're just we're just smacking each other up. Oh, it's spinning, bro. I'm kind of getting dizzy. What is going on? I made it. I'm the winner. Let's go. Place first, received 500 tickets. Too easy. Too easy. Okay. All right, all right, we need we need to we need to get to the roller coaster. We need to get to the roller coaster. This is not clickbait. Beware of the kraken in the water. He's out there. Or maybe not. Maybe we just need more lice. I don't know. <laughs> I like I like the integration of Mickey 30 throughout the map too. All right, all right. 
Yo! Hold up! Hold up! Yo! Oh my god! Imagine imagine this in VR though. This was Bro, I, I'm not I'm not even exaggerating, man. This actually is making me a little bit dizzy. They do got the, the speed and the, the momentum down though. Like this definitely feels like a real roller coaster. Okay, guys, so this is Fortnite Funland. There's definitely a lot more to explore, but for me, I'm gonna say Fortnite Funland is an A tier map. But I personally, you know, I want some action. I want some PvP. Speaking of action PvP, this next map might be just what we need. All right, I did not know this, but apparently Courage has a map. Burger Box PvP. This is Courage JD's map. Nah, come on. This wasn't my idea, Courage. But this is what. This is what's on the list, man. This isn't actually Courage JD's map. It's made by Master Ugwe. But what does it actually mean? Stinky burger. Gas your enemies with your stink bombs. Wait, that's it? I just get six stink bombs to get that. That's that's a lame power. Is there a better power? What, what was that sound effect? All right, time to use my power, man. All right, I'm not trying to take whoa he, he tried to run in okay your, your standard box pvp nothing too crazy going on i wasn't too impressed with the power i got there might be some cooler powers but i'm gonna give this one a, a, a c minus all right typical gamers super red versus blue Seventeen thousand players on it right now let's hop in and see what it's all about i want to say i do like the weapon format right here this is very clean you can see where all the weapons are so we got a super wheel for exotics you get to get coins every time you kill somebody um and there's also a super wheel for mythics that's a good way to kind of reward players for uh for getting kills sniper tower and item shop i'm interested in seeing that seeing the item shop oh cowboy voice anime voice oh japanese and english let me grab a couple quick eliminations and see how i can actually uh use the gold on this map and there's one more thing actually that i, I saw on this map that was actually very interesting that it that i think is uh contributing to why this map is doing so well compared to the other red versus blues out there so oh hold up, hold up that that sound effect on that kill was actually really sick i didn't hear it the first time i got a kill triple elimination all right now we're talking trolling eliminate the same player twice oh okay so this is actually what i was going to show you guys and then i got terminator eliminate five enemies so this map has a bunch of custom quests that tg added so that you can kind of level up as you're playing so it's called achievements you can open this right here now i can track all my achievements i already got terminator one and i got troll one and you can also go through all the ranks which is your standard fortnite ranking system all right tg time to rank this map it is performing extremely well but it is a concept that we have seen before red versus blue has been done many times it's a very clean well done red versus blue with some unique aspects to it so for that i'm gonna give it a b plus guys we have a bunch of maps to check out so let's get to the next one okay so jerian and jiven teamed up and made forever zone wars and there's also a duo version but i'm hopping into the solo version and everything i've seen about this map looks very interesting it's like constant action and the way to actually end the game is to get 10 eliminations in a row to drop a nuke i like this little intro it's happening right here i'm i'm already taking storm damage though okay okay i didn't realize it was pulling us back here so this storm is just constantly moving i'm gonna have to start off by popping this med kit and it looks like we have og loot because i have a campfire in my inventory oh but you know what the players that are respawning are just flying in i just realized that all right, we got a quick kill right there. Are these just, are these guys just gonna land on height on me? There's no way. You can never you can never keep height. All right, I have a gold pump now. Three kill streak. A few more kills, and I'll. Stay ahead of storm. Stay ahead of storm. It's actually pretty good practice for moving moving zone. I'm not gonna lie. This is actually really good practice. Guys, I'm gonna I'm gonna drop a nuke. No. Okay. I'm gonna say I'm gonna say that one is S tier because it's a very unique idea. It's really good practice. The only thing I didn't like is that people just keep 
redeploying on high ground so you can't ever really hold height which would be good practice for actual tournaments my arch nemesis noah's noah also has a map let's hop in guys who's better uh noah's noah or cypher pk noah's noah oh my god dude all right let's check out his map guys uh it's this big ramp and things are falling down you got to get all the way to the top if you really suck, you get gold so you can buy like peppers and speed boost. But this is a pretty easy map. I'm probably just going to walk right on through. Why is that thing? Why Why was it targeting me? Someone's trying to boogie bomb me. Yo, why am I getting grief? No one's no one has shooters, bro. He's sending his people to grief me, man. Oh my God. All right. I'm on orange already. Honestly, this map's not as dangerous as it, as it makes, you know, as it seems like. Oh, oh thank God I survived that. Yeah, he had to make sure that this map was really, really easy because um, I know his viewers are not really that good at Fortnite, so they they need all the help they can get. Uh, I feel like I'm going to regret talking all this trash. No, 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 no! All right, this map is stupid. Okay, I'm not going to lie. I had, I had some family over and some kids were there and I put on this map and it, it was entertaining them for like five hours straight. But if you're over the age of eight, you might not enjoy it for more than a few minutes. I'm giving this one an F. Tyler Ninja Blevins dropped the map. Let's see what it's all about. Already, this looks really well made. Ninja's flossing and as usual, no movement actually happening down here. This is like a training map. So you can train your aim, your building, editing, tunnel, peace, PVP. I know, I know Ninja's not doing any peace control, right? No way, that man hasn't built since chapter one. Ninja definitely needs to be playing this map a lot more because uh, there's, you know, I've seen him, I've seen him build lately. It's just, it's not a good look. How's the aim practice looking? Reflex trainer, speed aim trainer, aim reflex trainer. There's a lot of different training methods here. So, oh, there's even more options here. Small targets, medium targets. Let's do medium targets. Start. I like the stats on the left. You see that? Shots fired, miss, accuracy, react time, best time, average time. Okay, so obviously this map is not going to be as exciting because it is a practice map and it's just here to make you a better player, but it is really well made and there's a ton of different options. So I'm going to say this is a B plus. Okay, so now we're going back to my first ever UEFN map, Rocket Wars, because we just put out a huge update for this map and it is now officially the fastest Zone Wars map in Fortnite. Mammoth, pump, just like that. I'm the MVP. Look how fast this is, guys. Look how fast. All right, so I'm the MVP, and then we just go into this custom loading screen that we made. The match resets. No no need for the full Fortnite loading screen. And now we can pick our teams again, just like that. That is so much faster than every other Zone Wars map out there right now. And to celebrate this, I'm giving away 100 V-Bucks card to the first 100 people who get the rare Mythic Flopper windscreen on Rocket Wars. We're bringing back the OG Mythic Flopper that we did way back in the day when we launched this map. So if you get this rare windscreen, post it on my Discord, tweet it at me, show it to me on Instagram, and one of these V-Bucks cards will be yours. So let's check out the other maps and best of luck if you're hunting for this rare windscreen. All right, Booga's 1v1 map. It's your standard 1v1. Booga himself is hitting the gritty right here. Bro, wait, wait, wait. Why does he look so tall? Wait, is a secret with him? Who's he clipping, bro? He's clipping Casper the Ghost. <laughs> what was that? You can turn on cheats. What? Is this how is this how Booga wins the World Cup? Okay, so this is actually kind of cool. You can do custom crosshairs on this map. Uh, oh, I can do stretch res? Let's go back to the good old days. Hold on, how to do stretch res? I gotta enable it. Oh my god, I got stretch res on! What the hell? It's actually it's not actually giving you extra FOV. It's just kind of messing with your POV. Wait, the stretch res is actually making me into a demon chat. Oh my god! Booga's 1v1 map. It is your standard 1v1, but it has it has some flair to it. The custom crosshairs, the stretch resolution, the little Booga statue doing the gritty. I'll, I'll give it I'll give it a B minus. B minus. All right, my little brother, Junior PK, actually released this map. It's called Ultimate Box PvP. Okay, I'm spawning in this guy's box. What is going on? Okay, uh, oh, what the? Okay, so that dude just teleported into my box. That's crazy. Okay, Trap King, spawn box with trap on the nearest player. Okay, I just activated it. Oh my God, I just got a trap kill in here. Hold up, I trap killed this guy. Dude, there's no way I got Trap King as my first power from the 100 powers. What are the odds of that? That's crazy. But I did spawn in someone else's box, which I don't think was intended. This dude's flying around. All right, when can I when can I put somebody in it? Bro. 
Yo! Put him in a trap. Put him in a trap. Put him in a trap. I just put him in a trap, dude. What? Okay, okay. Yo, that's kind of crazy. I'm not gonna lie. This this map, it's you know, it's your power box PvP map. It's been a trend for a while. So it's not the most original idea, but sometimes these kind of silly, stupid ideas can be the most fun. Uh, I'm gonna give this one a C plus. Let's check out the next map. Clicks 1v1, zero delay. I'm hopping on this. And if the player I face is not sweaty, I'm giving this an F. All right, home to the seven time FNCS champion. What is that, bro? Get this off your map. That's terrifying. I wanna see if this is some good practice. If this guy is actually good, I'll give this map a high rating. If I destroy this guy. Full box. Uh-oh. All right, I'm not gonna lie. This is a pretty simple 1v1, but I'm not gonna do my boy clicks dirty. The people who play this map are gonna be a little bit more sweaty than your typical 1v1 map. Like I said, there isn't a lot going on here. So I'm gonna give this one a C plus, but I'm sure Clicks and his team are working on a lot more maps that could be rated higher. Okay, this one is called Tim the Tatman's Fall Damage. And there's a huge penguin looking at me. I do like the, the music that's playing right now, the snow effect. This is a Tim the Tatman take on only up. There is, is that a waffle? Did I, did I really just pick up a waffle? Because waffles are better than pancakes. So we got Tim's stream setup as well. Wait, this is actually a really clean look of a stream setup. We are trying to get to Florida. It's been so long since I played an only up map. And I, and I feel like this map actually like came out like a little bit later than the only up trend. If this came out like around the time when only up was popping off, it probably would have done like huge numbers. All right, Tim. Fall damage being your first map. Honestly, that's that that's pretty good branding. But the, the reality is that Tim didn't even beat this map. I watched him play this map when he released it and he never beat it. Like this dude did not beat his own only up map. Okay, hold up. Tim's ad breaks. This is how much money Tim makes from his ad breaks. That's why he runs ads on his stream 24 seven. No way, bro. Okay, so there's obviously still a long way to go. I'm not beating this whole thing right now, but Tim, you gotta at least beat your own map, man. Come on. Only up, it was really popular for a while. This is a good take at only up. I'm gonna give this one a C plus. Okay, so this map is top five gaming's map and he teamed up with Fode Zone. And these guys are extremely talented developers. So already off the rip, this is probably one of the cleanest UIs and transitions that we've seen in this entire video. These guys are very, very quality when it comes to the actual animations, UI, all that good stuff that kind of makes the map feel very complete. It's your standard box fight. These guys are going crazy on each other right now. I got two of these slurfish to pop. I got 11 HP, guys. How are we feeling? Hey! Dude, this transition right here with the round winner, that's sick. That's sick. That's really well made. Okay, so there's actually different modes. So that was high wall. This one is standard box fight. So this one's going to be two stories uh, high. And I guess it's like a little bit of a random rap, random weapon loadout as well. So, whoa, 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 buddy. Tommy from Top 5 Gaming and the team at Fode Zone, they are killing it on this map. I really like... Dude, it's so fast too. The thing about this map is that they they made it to be like the fastest box fight. I'm gonna put this one in S tier as well. Like they made box fights in a very, very clean way. And uh, I'm a fan of what they did here. All right, we got Mr. Beast. A YouTube video for Mr. Beast turned into a Fortnite map. This is a common trend. It's obviously not made by Mr. Beast, but let's hop in and see what they're cooking. Already there's $500,000. Am I competing against this bozo for it? So right off the rip, I'm just gonna try to blast this person. Okay, sorry, sorry, sorry. I didn't realize. I will unlock the door for you. Is that Mr. Beast? you need to survive many zombies waves. Prepare yourself and good luck. Wait, there's zombie waves that are coming up? Where are the zombies gonna come from? And how do I get this pump? Oh my God! Find the emergency generator. Oh, this thing opened up. 
Oh, I need a thousand coins to unlock the zone. Okay, this is definitely not a Mr. Beast video. Um, we're just we're just shooting zombies, but it is at least well made. So for that, I'll give it a C plus. Guys, thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Go check out Rocket Wars. We put all the new Chapter Five weapons in it, and you might get lucky and get one of the rare windscreens for a chance at five thousand V bucks. You can use this code or search up Rocket Wars in Fortnite Creative. Best of luck.